Hi, my name is Dex from MyConsult and today we'll be looking at one of the questions that one of our clients asked us recently. So what happens is, we actually need to key in an invoice and she wants to save it and an error appears. So let's try now. Huh? We press invoice. Alright, then we select our customer. Any customer, we press plus and then we select an item code and then we want to save. Okay, so if you are also receiving a message like that, that means that you have not added a physical year in AutoCount. So it also means that you cannot save any transaction that is not in that date range. All right. So actually to do this or to solve this problem, all you just need to do is let's say we cancel this first. All right. We come here to tools here. We come to manage physical year and come to the last one now is 2022. So let's say we want to create for 2023, we just press new next physical year. All right, so they open from 1st of January until 31st December. Once you're done, we just press OK. All right, so in the 2023, we can also do things like locking the period. So now if you're in January 2023, we do not want the users to actually key in anything after that. We press manage period lock. We can say, okay, we can tick all except for January. So once we've done that, means users can only key in anything that is dated January 2023 and if they try keying in February or March or April, the system will actually block them. Okay, so press OK, close this one. So then let's say now we want to create the invoice now. We press invoice. Now we select again the customer, JKL, we press plus and you see our date now is January. So we select the item here, set hardware and then we press save. So the system will automatically save it as per normal. But let's say for example, now we want to select February. So come here, select another customer, and then we change the date here manually. Come here to February 2nd, press plus, select the item, hardware, and then we press save. So the system tells you your period is locked. So you are not allowed to save. So this actually to prevent users from actually keying the wrong date on your invoices all right or your payment voucher or your supplier invoice okay so this is actually how easy it is to manage uh, locking periods and making sure your users do not key in wrongly and it actually keeps uh, your accounts especially for previous years or secure all right all right so if you have any other guides or any other questions you have please leave in the comment below and we'll try to prepare a guide for you like this. Thanks!